I'm Tony Lombardi with a Russell Street Recap, brought to you by Primary Residential Mortgage. Find out how Primary Residential Mortgage has helped 44 Marylanders save $1.3 million in student debt while becoming homeowners. Call Primary Residential Mortgage today at 443-384-6975. Back on June 3rd, I posed this question on our Twitter and Facebook pages. Johnny Unitas is clearly the greatest quarterback Baltimore has ever had. But who is second, Joe Flacco or Burt Jones? The results? 77.8% of voters responded that Flacco is Baltimore's second best all-time QB. The results aren't surprising given recency bias and given the fact that most who participate on social media are generally too young to have witnessed the talents of the rust and rifle. But the other 22.2% were right. Jones is the right choice. I remember running into Lydell Mitchell and Franco Harris in Ybor City prior to Super Bowl 35. I introduced myself to Lydell, said that I was from Baltimore and was a big fan. The conversation gravitated to the topic of Burt. Lydell couldn't say enough great things about the Baltimore Colts' number two overall pick out of LSU in 1973. Lydell emphatically declared that Burt was John Elway before Elway. He was tough, smart, mobile, and had a cannon for an arm. If you think Flacco has a good fastball, and he does, he couldn't bring it like Jones. Former teammate Bruce Laird once shared with me that during practice, if he got caught in coverage with his back to the quarterback, Jones in this case, he still knew when the ball was in the air. Why? Because Bruce could hear it sizzling through the air. That said, fastballs don't make the quarterback, but those who have watched both players perform during their primes know that Burt was the superior player, and it really isn't close. I'm Tony Lombardi.